Yo, 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 what's happening guys? Metaverse Melon here, how are we all today? Welcome back to another video, this is the exciting one. I've just been paid, so we're gonna invest some more money into Upland. First of all, I'm Metaverse Melon. I invest into Upland, which is basically a really good game. It's based on the real world, Web3. Everything's an NFT that you own, so you can actually add utility to the properties, all the structures you build on top of those properties. There's cars, there's FIFA, there's loads of other stuff as well. So get involved, I will put a link in the description down below where you can sign up to Upland today and I'll just show you where I actually invest my money, why I invest my money that way and just like the process of actually investing the best strategies, the best ways to actually get a good return for your money. So this is Upland, I'm mainly based in LA so if you actually look over here uh, you can see this is LA. Uh, I'll just zoom in. So every single property is based on a real life address in the real world. That's what brings Upland so much further ahead than any other game like i don't play games i'm not a gamer like i'm really not i'm more into stocks and investments but with upland you can like drive business you can actually create an idea and a plan and invest and then just grow that investment by adding like utility or certain events and other stuff around that you know like meta venture shops and like cars uh, like you can turn anything into a project like upland lays the foundation for you to actually grow so i could actually invest money in the store here so if you click on the store right now you can actually see 5,000 OPEX is $5, 10,000 OPEX is $10, so like 1,000 OPEX equals like $1. Uh, that's the way Upland works, so if I was going to invest in there, I'd get my like, say 100,000 OPEX for £100, $100, sorry. Uh, but what I'd do is actually go over to the secondary market here and actually click on here and you can see the best properties or you can actually go to UPX land or UPX world or other places like that and then you just go to properties, property search. I'm just going to go down to look for LA quickly right now. So if you actually look at Los Angeles, then the neighborhood will leave it off right now. We will go to Granada Hill soon though, because that's exciting. I want to raise the floor there as well. But if you look for sale, so what we'll do actually now is click for sale. Uh, but we'll go in OPEX quickly. And uh, now we won't, we'll go for dollar, US dollar, because we're going to invest dollars. And then we'll click FSA. Keep that for all right now actually, and then just search that and see what properties come up and then we'll sell it by uh, set it by sale price so three dollars 85 is the cheapest property in upland right now over 26 up2 so if you wanted to buy the cheapest property and sell it for a higher amount in upex that's the way you could do so but i actually like going on the game and actually looking at the properties using the secondary markets uh, some properties i might not get the best return for but i actually just really enjoy being involved in the game and it's a way to make these videos more entertaining i believe as well so yeah i don't really mind in the future i've grown this account a lot higher than i ever thought i would so i'm really happy where the account is right now so you can actually see what we will do though quickly is once we get a few properties here so you can see 399 for 65 right here and we'll just go on to it right now so I would buy this property for dollars because the property value will be about 8,000 upex someone's bought that and then trying to get dollars out of the game for 399 so all I'll do is buy that property and then set it for the floor price uh, sorry not the floor price but the price of property was actually uh, put on the um, upland for by upland so like before it was minted the original price um, I'll just put it on there for about 95% of the markup or 105% just depending where it is and I'll lower it just depending if it sells or it doesn't so uh, what we do in Upland is check here it brings in 81 so it's not the biggest growing property right now but what I will do is click buy because I'll be able to sell that for at least seven and a half thousand upex so, uh, this property will get bought we'll buy a couple more properties today as well so I'll get this property right now and we'll just go through this process so you can actually see this is um just to stop you being able to like uh just cheat it basically so i have to follow the bikes but i always get these wrong like let me know in the comments down below if how many times it takes you because i think it's just me but like everyone else finds it i don't believe i just got that one there and then we enter the code this just stops other people like getting on my laptop and selling properties because in the future there'll be a lot of value in some of these properties so it just keeps the account safe so seven eight eight seven eight and then i'll just enter this code quickly right now and now this gives me access to my wallet, which is my Upland wallet. You can see I've got about $2.08, I believe it was. So that's actually in the wallet from sales in Upland. You can either sell for Upex or you can sell for dollars. So I sell for Upex because I'm trying to grow the account for Upex. I believe like growing the Upex return and the value of the properties. And then in the future, I've got more compounds. So when I want to take dollars out of the game, I've got a better advantage ahead. But you can see I've got $2.05 in my wallet. And I'll just keep growing that. Like I've got about five properties on sale for dollars. But right now we're going to buy this on like the debit card and all we do is click on the buy button 
and then it's minting it on the blockchain so once this goes through i'll actually own the property and then i can do what i want to do with that property so i can either like raise the value by building a structure on top of that property or i can actually like go and uh, just raise the value you know i could have bought a property in granada hills and actually like talked about on this channel and other stuff and grown the actual value so basically like i think of this as a a share of a stock so like basically the properties are the shares and then like the stock is like la and then all i'm doing is buying like lots of stock when it's low and then over time once more people come into Auckland and the growth of la and more players are minting out properties right now granada hills is going down 50 60 properties a day getting minted right now it's crazy so every day the value is going up of all those properties so the more you invest at the start like the easier it is to grow but this is not financial advice this is just what i like to do to grow my account and it's been very successful going forward so i can't wait to hit 10 million uh, once i hit chief executive uh, not chief executive sorry executive i'll be able to actually like put uh, more spark the 1.2 i'll get upgrading on spark week um, on top of that into like other stuff and then once we hit the five spark we'll get the factory online uh, once we get the factory online we'll be able to start like creating assets we'll get a 3d designer involved and we'll, we'll actually start buying properties like um and then just selling like loads of different stuff out of the factory as well so uh, that's what i was actually meaning to go in sorry i was concentrating on the sale button here but yeah with the factory we actually plan to like give away the first mints to players what have actually helped build the factory so we've still got the names on the phone and then we'll go through that and actually like give away the first one to ten mints or the one to twenty mints depending on how many people stake spark on the factory so yeah we'll go back to all that kind of old videos and like have a look at it that's a power of youtube uh, we can actually go back and find out what actually happened when it happened the names everything because i kind of go through all the properties and all the names on each video so i can just go back and look at it and we can actually like reward players in the future so like the factory would have made you some opex for putting spark on but maybe next year the factory makes more money than it was meant to you know and you'll get a little a little payment you know so something fun like entertaining for the people what use a discord and in granada hills hopefully we can grow it into something what's really like really good for the players and just the growth and to keep it growing so i'm not gonna look through there there's not really much right now but a couple of properties but i'm gonna go over to grab a hill quickly because this is where all the fun is right now i want to see what's going on uh, just let this load quickly and i'll actually go up to uh, upx land and then we'll just change this to granada hills quickly and then we'll go to search again so now we'll actually see the cheapest price in dollars so sale price is five dollars five there's a lot of five dollar properties and five dollar forty five seventy five six dollars fifty one percent markup so all these properties i could actually sell for a hundred percent so ten thousand upex and actually make a sale but i'm going to hold them because i believe in the floor and see if you're buying properties in granada hills you'll be able to sell this so i'll buy all the properties underneath the value and then you'll be able to sell your properties for six dollars so this is like the strategy i use like i'm going to invest in upland anyway i may as well invest into granada hills i may as well raise the floor and i've got a lot of other properties as well so all we do is click on the address go over to upland quickly and then just paste it in here we'll click paste and then we'll go over to this address quickly right now and then it'll just show me it's five dollars i'll show you through the process quickly uh, we'll just click on it five dollars there 81 brings in 119 so that's a great property to own i'd pay five dollars for that anyway in like upland so we want to try and get those away anyway because like that's really good value i can build like apartments and other stuff on this land as well and we've got twenty five thousand upex because we did sell like two properties overnight uh so those upex will go to like raising the floor again we'll buy two more properties in granada hills for upex also raising my stake to about 200 220 properties in granada hills uh, we'll just let this go through and we'll buy another property and we'll just buy all the floor in granada hills um, and then i'll try and put some more upex or some more dollars into other properties like we'll just keep raising it see how far we can actually raise it before the card stops because you get 30 transactions a day and then i'll have to wait till midnight to actually start using it again i learned that when i first started playing upland in the uk i'm bank of scotland uh, but what you can only do is 30 transactions each day so if i use my card 30 times to pay for something uh, so it stopped me like buying stuff but i need to like put a, a larger amount into my upland account at once uh, but i've just been buying properties like one after one so the bank rang me up wondering what's going on so uh yeah i need to stop doing that so we'll go on to this again i believe i've bought like three or four things today so we should have about 26 well after what we've paid on upland probably about 22 now <laughs> oh coffee it's basically 
quarter past 11 at night right now i've just finished work so i wanted to film this video i uh, just got home me and my partner so filming this video quickly like we're going to actually buy some more properties if you just started watching this video right now uh, we're raising the floor of granada hills so we've just bought this property here and we're going to keep buying all the properties raising the floor you can see it going down i'm just going to do this quickly if i can we'll buy this property as well click on the paste button if you're liking this content as well, if you're joining Granada Hills, if you're not already subscribed, please click that subscribe button. We're trying to hit 500 subscribers to get monetized. Once we get monetized, we'll just put all the ad revenue back into Upland. So we'll actually uh, just keep reinvesting in Granada Hills, growing like my property is growing, your property is at the same time. Uh, because anyone what jumps in, like I'll always give the information on this YouTube channel or on the Granada Hills Discord node. So if you're not already involved with that, uh, join it down below in the description. There's a lot of players actually chatting away doing business. So if you want to make some OPEX or dollars on Upland, like you're more than welcome to join. It's like an open community, really good community. Uh, everything's really good over there so if you want to actually join it you're more than welcome to just wait for this to go through it's really slow tonight my, in my internet's like slowed down but i notice once i go downstairs like it's so much faster than like the walls in this house uh, it's a little cottage basically um, but the signal just gets cut like the more you like away from it so the route is downstairs but i should have put it upstairs uh, so every time i like upload a video i go downstairs and it's done in like half an hour so the internet's really fast but it just it's the way i need to get a new router because like you can actually do a i heard about a thing i actually watched it on youtube it was like you can actually like create access for your laptop to be the number one priority so um it'll get the number one priority signal before any other device in the house which is like everything else will still run great but it just means like this won't run very slow once i'm filming and doing other stuff uh, but yeah, we've got another property, so we'll just keep buying the floor. That's minted on the blockchain, so we'll get the next property quickly, which is here. And then we'll go, just let that go through. Done. And then back to the search bar, we'll buy the next property. And then because there's only four, th I say there's only 14,000 properties in Granada Hills, but if like we're minting out like 40, 50 a day, like I'll only have to challenge probably like 2,000 of those properties, maybe like 1,500 properties by the time all the other players have jumped on it as well. Uh, so I believe like going forward and there's another probably another like three pays after this I'll be able to get like the majority stakes or anyone else will like tries to lower the floor we can just buy it faster and faster without running out of money or upex uh, holding the value for your properties as well not just mine so the more you've got in Granada Hills like you can just see a stable floor if not it going up someone might drop it down to three four dollars but it'll like only last a few hours you know we can come in very quickly and actually like raise that floor back up so all your assets are like um, looked after and granada hills is going to be on this youtube channel for like the next year two three years so, like your investment's always going to be shown on like youtube and then the more followers and the more subscribers will come to like my twitter uh, this youtube channel it'll just raise more awareness more eyeballs on your properties more people coming into the game and more people coming into granada hills uh, means you'll get more sales as well hopefully going forward so if you want to get a meta venture shop that kind of thing but yeah this is not financial advice but i just want to drive a lot of utility to granada hills so, and i believe we can actually do that i believe we're doing it already I believe like the last two three months have been absolutely amazing you know everyone said about a node i was just like in upland looking for something to do for a little bit of fun and then once i found upland and actually the power of what you have and i realized how much power and how much like um like how much um like movement we can actually make in the market altogether and like as long as you like be responsible with that power and that responsibility and like you know it's not just trying to get money out of the game you know this youtube channel will be going for the next 10 20 years i like i want to play upland for the rest of my life i want to be involved with the community you know it's great uh, so it'll be good like upland like granada hills will be the first thing like this channel actually does what's big and then like the next thing will be something in the future you know but i always plan to hold granada hills and all the properties in it i might sell like a few properties in granada hills but i'll always want to try and keep granada hills like the majority stake i don't want someone to come in and buy like six thousand properties and then i can't ever uh, get it back or like lose out for the players investing you know what i mean so it'll always be really safe investment it'll always be uh controlled and slow and like your money can be uh looked after in that node so yeah what we're actually going to do is see if we've already bought this property i don't think i have no i have <laughs> and then we'll go to the next one then which is this one here so five dollars again i'll need to refresh a page and then it'll take all those off sale so what we'll do is click on this quickly and then take that away and then search that that's not searched oh, 
there we go. Oh, it's gone now. Go back into it. Paste that. There we go. More coffee. Right, five dollars. We'll get this one as well. See, all these properties have been really good UP2 size, so I'm actually out raising the floor of Granada Hills, but I'm actually creating a really good investment for the own James UK like Upland channel as well. So you've got to realize the bigger this channel grows, the more like OPEX it generates, the more I can give away, the more videos I've got to film, the more like live hours we can actually do film, you know, like giveaways every day. Uh, like at the start, it's every month right now. Currently, we do giveaways, and like on this video as well, if it gets 50 likes, we'll give away 5,000 upex. All you have to do is put your IGN, your in game username down below in the comments. And I did talk about last video actually i have to apologize i talked about cryptocurrency and i know upland's not a cryptocurrency game i was really tired when i was filming that video i have to think about the actual process of are the videos flowing properly is it good are the lights okay like is it filming is it still recording you know i don't want to go through the whole process imagine buying like two three hundred dollars worth of properties and then realizing that the screen recorder wasn't turned on or so like i get a lot of um a lot of things run through my head while I'm actually filming these videos live. There's no scripts. Uh, I do apologize about that. Upland's a token. I'm well aware of that. Like The reason I actually invest into Upland is because of that reason. Like There's no way it's going up or down. Like It's a token. It's a set price for $1. So, no matter if you invest like $10 or $10,000, you don't have to worry about like the fluctuation of the market or anything like that. And that's what attracted me to Upland at the start. Like uh, You can actually raise the assets in your portfolio, which is actually your NFTs. Well, I minted on the blockchain, then you don't actually have to do any of the technical work, set up wallets. Upland does the whole process. You just need an email and password, just like setting up Facebook, basically. So what we'll do back here is go to the sale price, and now you can actually see... We've got lots of so six ninety nine. We can raise the floor. Hopefully, the car doesn't run out by then. So what we'll do is actually click on this property right now. Go to Upland again and search. Hopefully, this isn't this property. It might be though. No, it's not. So we'll, oh, we've already got that property as well. Hopefully, this refreshes. Have we got this property? We'll try this one again. Hopefully, this one's not been bought yet. And we'll just keep buying properties until the card stops <laughs> working. So this one's not worked. Here we go. See if we've actually got this one already. Now I've not got this property right now, so we'll buy this one. Oh, prop I hope I've not. No, I've not. It's not got a number over it. Let this load up. There we go. And then we'll buy this property as well. And then this will just keep raising the floor. So hopefully now Granada Hills won't go down to $5. There'll be a lot of people trying to just make some money quickly. But then a lot of players will actually realize it's a lot smart to hold your properties in Granada Hills. So right now you're getting your money out. But like I'm going to hold as many properties as I can. Or like the, like the set at a high markup. You know, you're not going to get any value out of like my Granada Hills property unless you win a competition. And that's just like to help raise the value. That's not me being big headed or anything. Like if the floor can drop that low like what's the point of like the investment because it's like it's risky you know what i mean like you may as well know in confidence that the floor's just gonna get kept getting bought up you know as soon as the floor drops it's just getting bought up which is keeping the value so if you own a hundred properties in granada hills that like you bought them for four dollars and then you want like eight dollars out of them if the floor keeps dropping down again like there's no way like you're going to lose confidence in this. You're going to lose confidence in me and like this YouTube channel. So, yeah, why would I want to do that when I've got enough OPEX like, actually coming in anyway? And I plan to invest this money anyway. So that's why I want to give away dollars to the subscribers as well. Because I'll always invest into Upland. I want to grow this account. And I believe like between like twenty to $30,000 will be the perfect amount over the next like three years. Three to five years to grow this account. To a point where I never have to invest again. I can just like buy for fun in the future if I ever wanted to. Uh, but that's the plan and the growth. And that's why I started this YouTube channel. I never realized it would become like what it is now. And I thought it would just be a small channel which I could document. And maybe me and my friends could see the videos. I never expected it to turn into this. But a lot of players are jumping onto Upland right now. And it's really cool to see. Once Tokyo and that comes out as well. It'll be like the whole of Asia. You've got Europe, America. Um, it's just so much fun as well so yeah get involved link in description if you want to sign up to upland today if you're not already subscribed please click that subscribe button click like as well share these videos it really does help the channel grow 
uh, really does help push this video to uh, video to more people as well so we've just bought that property as well so hopefully now if we just refresh it we'll go down again then sale price there's one more property but i don't know if this is a property i've already bought it might just be taking a lot of time to go through like to me on the blockchain uh, so everything's done on the blockchain every property you own is an nft so i already own that property so once this goes through secure an ownership like that'll be my property that i own so like all the like uh, behind the scenes is mine like everyone can see the details so like you're not just buying properties like you're actually buying it and you own it just like just i'm not going to say cryptocurrencies but like a bitcoin like you know what i mean like you hold the amount of the bitcoins uh, uh, with this like this is always yours and everyone knows like that's your property and then with spark which is like the power you can actually build a structure on top of that or uh, loads of other stuff like sharp meta venture in the future uh, like once you get an application approved and stuff so there's a lot of entertainment and a lot of like value you can add to the property as well to make it grow so what we'll do is go back over here quite right now where we'll click on the next property i know i've not bought this so hopefully once this one goes off the market i'll be able to raise the floor like right now once we buy this property we would have raised the floor to five dollars forty so we'll just get this property quickly right now and like i was saying earlier as well like you know a lot of people are trying to sell for dollars right now but the floor is going up so like if you sell for five dollars right now and you've got 10 properties you could have sold for six dollars so you've just lost ten dollars and you can get the money out like if you need to get the money out fair enough i understand that but if you really want to make money in upland you've got to play the long game like i will say that like upland i've learned over the last 10 11 months that you can make a lot of money and get a lot of money out but you've got to be really strategic when you want to take that money out and how you're going to take that money out so uh, what I do is plan to like grow for the next three to five years. There's no plan to uh, try and get money out. I'm not stressed about needing the investment. This is not money that um, I need to pay my rent or anything like that. All my bills have been paid. Every standing direct debit and order has been already paid for. So now uh, this is money for me and my partner. So like we both have money on the side. And then this is what I do for my hobbies. Uh, and then, yeah, I'll grow this and we share this as well. So everything that I make on this will go for our future. Um, and just like the way like I can work less hours and other stuff so hopefully even if I can't leave the work I can like work less hours I could go part time maybe in the future you know a lot of stuff like it's a dream but like hopefully we can make that come true and if we do you'll be able to see all the videos of how it became possible so we just bought that property as well and then we'll go back up here so we just bought the 575 I believe let's just click on it just make sure we have What's the property is that? 16834. 16834. So yeah, we've just bought that property. So now the floor price is gonna be six dollars. So we'll go back to this quickly right now. And then we'll go not on here, that's a secondary market. We'll go back over here. Uh, we'll click on the six dollar one so if you're just tuning in right now we're raising the flora granada hills uh it's got been at five dollars we've just got it up to six dollars right now and then we're just going to buy this property right now i won't keep raising the floor too high so people can actually get into granada hills before it all sells out uh we'll be minting like all the profits here will be going to raising the floor in upex or for minting out profits in granada hills right now so the channel is going to be dedicated for granada hills for at least the next three months uh, we're going to be minting as many properties every time i make profit on upland i will be minting out granada hills properties or i will be buying the floor either for dollars or for upex as well so we're going to hit every single market in the like upland um, game uh, we're going to target dollars upex and we're also going to target the unminted properties the more properties that are unminted the less properties are left the more we can actually use the strategy and the secondary market to raise uh, so what we'll actually do right here is go here uh, six dollars so we'll buy the second run wait now kingsbury street so that's right next to the factory uh, what we'll do is click here paste see where this property is for sale click on this and buy this one as well so now the floor will be up at over six dollars so what we'll do is click on this and then tomorrow unless anyone's put any more properties for sale for five dollars we'll be able to buy them and then like think about the strategy like the more properties what get bought and the more players now what buy the five dollar properties the more the the floor will stay up at six dollars or seven dollars you know and soon you won't see the floor under ten dollars uh, if you bought a property at five six dollars you know 
it won't you won't be able to get a property in Granada Hills soon for less than ten dollars. Uh, yeah, we're going to really raise the floor. We'll collect our earnings quickly right now. You can see all the sends. So each property creates a yield as well you know all the properties i own create a yield so every single hour i get a certain amount of upex about 140 upex an hour right now plus all the visits as well so anyone like jumps on my property i get like a, a 25 upex like um collection yield for like the player actually being able to send to my property and um, so i just get that that's a little like bonus as well so my earnings like i earn about 100,000 or 101,000 probably now after buying all these properties um, and then about 10,000 upex every single month comes from Sen. So that's about 110,000 upex I earn a month off Upland. And then all the sales as well. So if I actually quickly look at messages, uh, you can see here um, all the properties what I've sold even today. We've just sold another two properties 9,000, 10,000, 7,500, 10,000. So yeah, all these properties go back 40,000. Uh, so yeah, we've been selling properties every single day for the last two, three months now. And then the more properties I own, the more sales I'll make. Uh, probably own over well over 830 properties right now. Uh, we've just bought the $6. Have we bought the 6 Heaven No, we need to buy this now. So this, the floor price is now $6.75. So we'll soon be up at $7. So like the floor has gone up $2. Uh, uh, yeah, you'll see that and all your properties. If you bought a property already in Granada Hills, now there's $2 more value for that property. So Every single subscriber, say there's like a hundred people watch this video, like two hundred dollars have been like uh, generated for us. So uh, yeah, that's great. So like, if you don't like these video, if you like these videos, uh, please support the channel. Please make sure you're subscribed. It really does mean the world for me. We'll keep drawing these videos. We'll keep investing in Upland, and we'll keep growing the floor. I'll show you the process of actually like getting money out in the future as well. But I don't recommend it right now. There's not like, it's not like, let's get the money out and let's get, this is like a dividend portfolio to me. This is going to be where I can get money out each month when I need to and I can use it and then eventually I sell something for a big amount and that'll set me up for a couple of months. And But yeah, I always plan to be in like employment and I always plan to like go forward and like earn on the side. So yeah, this is money that I don't go out and waste in like the pubs and drinking and like just all the random stuff I used to buy. So it's kind of like an investment going forward for myself. So this is not investment advice, but for myself, I really do believe in Upland and the actual process. Uh, uh, what we'll do right now is go to, I think I've just bought that one there. So we'll go to this one. Yeah, we've just bought that one. And then we'll click paste. Trying to get through all these properties quickly right now so we can actually see the floor go up. And then once uh, it declines me to buy anything else, uh, that's when I'll actually just stop right there and then we'll like go on to it tomorrow and like do some more minting out granada hills and we'll keep going 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 and seeing how it works and uh, just seeing where we can actually get the floor so yeah really good at times like please like subscribe and comment if you're not already and let me know what you're building in upland a lot of players are actually asking what the best property we should buy or construct in upland i believe it's like the apartments ranch houses are really good anything what's got a high value you know you can actually add utility to it so i believe in like something like um apartment would be the best um but i like ranch houses next to the factory you know like the apartments don't look too nice next to the, i don't know it's like it's totally up to you guys like i don't want to uh, decide what it's actually gonna be but i do believe in it just i just want it to look cool you know what i mean but i believe like the players will make it look amazing anyway so uh, we've got that one simon street so yeah sometimes i'm like too chilled about it but like yeah we'll go on the granada nodes and we'll all chat about it after this video i'll push i'll publish this video on the the node chat and we can actually all talk about what we should be building in granada hills and yeah i'll probably learn off one of you guys you know i'm new to upland so i've been on this game less than a year about 11 months now 10 and a half months uh i believe next month so ginger yeah or august by the end of next month yeah about a month 11 months i've been on upland <laughs> so next month it'll be a year's anniversary as well so i'll actually do Hopefully a live stream and like talk to you guys live and we can mint properties out maybe on next payday. Uh, we'll do the live stream instead of filming this video and uploading it. We'll actually do it interactive with you guys. Uh, uh, we can all be involved together. Uh, so we'll buy this property right now. Uh, Six ninety nine, And then this is 79 UP2 size. So now the floor of Granada Hills is up at $7. So that's really cool for the first time. So we'll just refresh this. Uh, just so you can actually see it change hopefully it does hopefully it refreshes that five dollar property has been changed now so sale price that property still not gone off but we'll click on it see if we can buy it just to show that it's 
been bought already, but if it's not, we'll click on it again. Oops. Maybe it was me. <laughs> now we'll click off that quickly. Click paste again. There we go. See if this property has been bought. Yeah, I've already owned this property, so that might just be taking a while. So now you can see the floor is $7, 725 So yeah, this is where it's actually getting fun. So we'll look at that property, an 81% markup, so that's like quite a good markup. So you won't make much off this, but this will raise the floor up. And then we've also got dollars for quickly. We won't just keep buying the floor. I'll do that behind the scenes as well. Uh, but you can see the process of me just buying those properties right now. And what we'll actually do is go into for sale in OPEX quickly and search that. And then we'll look at the sale price. So 9,977, so like the floors, whoa, the floor's nearly at 10 grand in Granada Hills. I never expected that, so we'll just keep raising that as well, we'll get it up to 10. So we'll buy this properly quickly right now for OPEX now, instead of dollars, so you can either buy for dollars or OPEX, depending on what they're selling the property for. Uh, so we've got some OPEX left here, we've just collected our earnings. So we'll go over to this person in Granada Hills and buy the property they're selling. And then this will stop there being too many properties on sale in Granada Hills as well, so... Oh, they've got the jail, so I'll pay 10,496 instead of 9,997. But why, why did the other person have to pay double then? Let me know in the comments down below, because I'm actually... Last time that someone was in jail, I seen it, and it was like, you had to pay 20,000, basically. Why is that only 10,500? I don't mind paying that at all. <laughs> Cheers. So now we've just bought... Can I actually use that property now, though? Does that... Never bought property off someone what's in jail. Let's see if it works. Ten, that does say 10,000, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Imagine if my account just goes, like... I better not put in, be putting Alcatraz for this. Hopefully it goes through. wonder what they've been doing as well to get in jail. Like, I would, like... I just... I don't get why... Yeah, it doesn't, I don't understand it, like, you know, there must be a way to make, like, lots of money in Spark, but, like, yeah, like, why would you ruin the game? Yeah, I can't buy this property, like, I just don't believe in, like, yeah, why would you do that kind of stuff? So now we can't raise the floor, now we've got someone in jail in Granada Hills. So now we'll have to go to the next property, which is this one, see so if we can buy this. I hope this is like a peaceful neighbourhood, like not full of, full of criminals. <laughs> so what we'll do is click on this one quickly. And hopefully this one, this one hopefully is not in jail. Buy this property quickly. This one will go through. So hopefully that one in jail, he comes out of jail quickly, like, hopefully we could just pay his bond, or, I don't know, it depends what he's been put in for, if he's been put in for cheating, like, let's just keep him in jail. But then, like, I want to buy the property so the floor can go up, so, yeah, I don't know, actually, that's kind of annoying. Um, so we can't buy that property there, Ferraro, Ferraro, so what we'll do is go to Upland. Paste this property quickly. We've got 18,000 UPEX left. So we'll be able to buy one more property for UPEX. And then tomorrow morning, I'll be able to buy another property once I get to 10, 11,000 UPEX again. And then we'll just click on this property. Hopefully, I can buy this if the internet works. There we go. And then we'll get this property quickly as well. So that should raise the floor up. We'll obviously have to get that property. The guy's in jail, but. Hopefully we can find a way to buy that property. I'll like send a tweet out, you know, see what happens with that. Uh, see if we can actually like get access to that property. Hopefully we can, because we could have raised the floor up to 10,000 UPEX um, if we actually could buy that property, but we can't. So sadly, that will get the our account down to like 8,917 or whatever. And then tomorrow morning it'll be back up at 11,000. Um, around about that money, probably about 10,000 and then tomorrow afternoon it'll be at 11,000 uh, so we'll try and buy that get players property again hopefully I sell some of the other properties for UPEX as well uh, but yeah I'll keep buying properties from the secondary market we'll keep raising the floor up as well I'll just go over LA quickly show you the strategy so we'll just hover over the whole of LA uh, click the neighborhood you can do this in any city and then I've just gone the secondary market 
and I'm actually looking for the property quickly which has got a high UP2 size uh, but like a really good dollar amount and that just like indicates someone's trying to sell the property quickly uh, and then I usually just scoop those properties up and then flip them for double the amount in UPEX uh, what we'll do actually is look 68 right here so this property I'll just click on for four dollars let's just see where this property is at it's bringing in 84 so now nah, I'll leave that property we're not going to just invest money for the sake of it uh, we just want to invest on really good strategies like so like it's sometimes it's best not to invest you know you have to be very it's not like you see all the money going in but there's a lot of properties that have not even like i've had the money and i've just not bought as well so maybe i'll talk a bit more about that as well it's not just like chuck dump your money in and try and get a return it's like buy the best properties when someone like drops it when it's like half 50 percent off like buy it instead of 70 percent off you know uh, instead of sorry 30 percent off or something like that so that's basically how i run it so what we'll do is wait till tomorrow we'll film another video uh, we'll keep raising the floor now granada hills is at seven dollars at exciting times uh we'll be able to see that on the data hopefully tomorrow and then anyone who's bought a property for four to five dollars will be able to sell that for seven dollars now which is awesome and then if you hold the property the property will just keep going up in value as well and then you can do the same strategy guys you can keep buying the floor as well and then obviously there's only fourteen thousand properties in granada hills and then and there's only about 4,000, less than 4,000 now probably, unminted properties. So once that goes down, you own about, well, we own as a um, basically a community, at least two, 3,000 of the properties. Uh, which is 25% and we just keep buying and keep buying own half of Granada Hill so we can just control it eventually and just keep it really what it is today and just like in the future it'll be built out so we can keep it stable and just keep it growing so yeah hope you're really enjoying the content guys really hope you're enjoying the videos uh, let me know in the comments what I should talk about next and then we'll do another video tomorrow we'll invest some more dollars into Upland see where the account is we'll just show you quickly actually before I go uh, where the account is sitting at right now so after that investment, we'll actually look at the property tab, uh, see how much this account's bringing in each month now. So every property I bought, so you can see here now it brings in 101,448 UPEX every single month, which is amazing. Uh, and then the account's now at 6,525,312 UPEX. Uh, we've not invested that much. We've only invested about $75, uh, but that's really cool just to see where the floor's gone up. And then we'll do the same thing tomorrow. We'll just keep raising the floor. Uh, we'll get this well over 7 million, 7 point two million probably and then we'll be able to like double that to be up to about eight eight and a half million by next payday and then we'll be able to raise that again to about nine point four and then i'll slowly raise the account up to ten million so i cross it once we hit spark week so we'll be chief executive so hopefully in about a year's time to um well by the time like obviously the end of august the so next month's payday i'll be able to get this account up to seven point eight will be very close so we might even do we'll do something to try and hit it for like our anniversary but i think we might be a little bit off it but yeah we'll see what happened guys but yeah if you've watched all the way through thank you so much for the support please like subscribe and comment it means the world to me in this account we'll get it grown and once we hit 350 subscribers we will be giving away 3.5 spark for five days so you can actually build one of your structures some of the partners in upland have actually done this competition so yeah that's really amazing of those people and yeah we'll be giving that away to one of you guys 3.5 spark for five days all you have to be is subscribe to this channel and have a structure actually actively getting built in upland so uh, uh, yeah comment down below your ign your in-game username let me know what you're building if you're involved with granada hills right now if you're actually made some money there's a lot of players chatting about like returns right now which is cool to see it actually working so yeah love to hear from you guys i'm on upland at james uk as well so yeah see you tomorrow for another video peace